Here I am set up in uh, a little place called um, Housel Bay and um, just behind me here I've got a, a nice colony, small colony of, of fulmers and I'm just sat here really just enjoying watching them, uh, a bit of pair bonding, a bit of uh, confrontation with a few other unpaired fulmers, um, beautiful birds, tube noses, absolutely wonderful to watch, really really long lived birds actually. I think they can live in excess of sort of 50, 60 years. So, you know, a, a really fine bird. Um, and they, they're quite happy with me here. I think they're quite used to people um, coming down here, picnics, just looking at the sea. So I think they're quite happy. So really beautiful to photograph. Got a bit of video in there. Um, hoping that the chuffs are gonna show. I think they'll agree. In fact, I just heard some chuffs there just coming in. Um, and jackdaws. So uh, yeah, beautiful, really, really nice. Got some nice shots, just gotta sit, enjoy, and uh, see what can turn up.
so currently at the moment I've got um, got two camera bodies on the go uh, I've got Canon 600 there and the 5DSR to do a bit of video and uh, to do some stills as well and I've also got a trusty 1DX just some faster shots for birds coming into land um, and anything that just will pop, could pop up really always good to have a, a second body in your arsenal when you're in a situation like this because if swinging this thing around a bit too uh, usually I've missed them they're uh, pretty much gone so uh, yeah not always the case having two cameras with me but today yeah it's, it's nice to have well it's certainly nice to be here nice to be out in the fresh air it's all very quiet it's kind of pretty chilled out really um, just watching the world go by there's uh, lots and lots of rock pipits around ravens about performers are quite happily playing and displaying um, but yeah there's no seals as yet um, we've got uh, a great population of seal here I've just seen round the corner three seals feeding um, and hoping that uh, they'll make their way around and um, have a little bit of feed here we can get a bit of video a bit of close-up and maybe um, maybe get a couple shots but it's not particularly good for getting shots so high up of obviously the seals in the water but uh, certainly at this angle here with the formers right behind me I can get a an eye to eye view which is great um, and, get, and get fairly tight in on them as well um, but to be honest I was going to leave my vlogging cam at home today but I thought well I'll better take it just in case but uh, yeah it's oh, it's wonderful to be out
um, uh, decided to call it a day now. Um, I've been here for about sort of two hours, two, three hours. Um, had a really nice time, a little bit cold. Um, but nice to be out on the cliffs, just clear the cobwebs. Um, you know, seen quite a bit today. Spent a bit of time with the formers, just been watching some um, from Gannets, just out sea feeding. Managed to grab a little bit of video with the 600, not sure what it's going to turn out like, but uh, just to give a bit of an idea really. Um, it's quite a cheeky old wind as well, which I didn't expect today. I think it's just picked up this afternoon. Um, but uh, hopefully many more coastal vlogs to come uh, now that spring has started. It still feels a bit like uh, winter, but I hope to spend a lot more time um, down here with the seabirds. Um, when they've got eggs and chicks and things like that so and the chuffs are obviously breeding as well and uh, we've got you know quite a lot more bird species around feeding and, and and breeding so uh yeah until next time in probably a nice sunny may with lots of green vegetation clear blue skies and flat calm seas uh, until next time thanks for watching